The Boeing F-47 represents the most significant leap in military aviation since the dawn of stealth technology. While our adversaries celebrate their own sixth-generation prototypes, the United States Air Force has quietly moved from concept to production, and the implications are staggering. This isn't just about replacing the F-22 Raptor. We're talking about a complete transformation of how America projects air power across the globe. In the next few minutes, you'll discover why this single aircraft has defense analysts calling it the most revolutionary fighter ever conceived, how it's designed to command entire swarms of AI-powered drones, and why our rivals are desperately trying to match capabilities they barely understand. To understand why the F-47 represents such a paradigm shift, we need to examine the threat environment that demanded its creation. The Next Generation Air Dominance Program began in earnest, following DARPA's Air Dominance Initiative study in 2014, but the urgency became crystal clear as China and Russia accelerated their own sixth-generation programs. President Trump announced the Boeing contract selection in March 2025, ending a competition that saw proposals from Lockheed Martin and Northrop Grumman fall to Boeing's revolutionary design. But here's what makes this timeline so remarkable. Experimental F-47X planes have been flying in classified test programs since 2019, accumulating thousands of flight hours while our adversaries were still drawing blueprints. The strategic calculus driving NGAD is simple yet profound. America's fifth-generation fighters, particularly the F-22 Raptor, were designed for conflicts of the 1,000, 990 seconds, and 2,000s. Today's threat environment, particularly in the Indo-Pacific, demands aircraft capable of operating at unprecedented ranges while facing the most sophisticated air defense systems ever deployed. China's recent unveiling of both the J-36 and J-56 generation fighters has validated American intelligence assessments about the pace of adversary development. Russia continues advancing its PAC-DP program, though with considerably fewer resources than Beijing. What's become clear is that the window for maintaining American air superiority is narrowing rapidly. Air Force Chief of Staff General David Alvin recently confirmed that Boeing has begun manufacturing the first production F-47, with initial flight testing planned for 2028. The Air Force plans to procure 185 plus F-47 seconds initially, representing an investment that will define American air power for the next three decades. Consider this. Every month of delay potentially hands our adversaries additional time to close the capability gap. The F-47 specifications read like science fiction, but they represent engineering reality backed by decades of research and development. With a combat radius exceeding 1,000 nautical miles, roughly 25% greater than existing American fighters, this aircraft can reach deep into contested airspace where current platforms simply cannot survive. But range is just the beginning. The F-47's top speed of Mach 2 Plus masks its most revolutionary capability. Supercruise efficiency is powered by adaptive cycle engines that fundamentally change how fighter aircraft operate. Both General Electric's XA-102 and Pratt & Whitney's XA-103 engines employ three-stream adaptive cycle technology, allowing real-time reconfiguration between fuel efficiency and maximum thrust. Here's why this matters strategically. Traditional engines optimize for either cruise efficiency or combat performance, never both. The F-47's adaptive engines can switch modes instantaneously, providing supercruise capability for extended range missions then transitioning to maximum thrust for combat maneuvering. This isn't incremental improvement, it's a fundamental leap in propulsion technology that enables mission profiles impossible for previous generations. The aircraft's stealth characteristics represent what defense analysts call broadband low observability. It means reduced signatures across multiple spectrums simultaneously. While fifth-generation fighters primarily focused on radar stealth, the F-47 incorporates advanced infrared signature reduction, acoustic dampening, and even electromagnetic spectrum management. According to defense contractors, 
This creates a spectral dominance capability that makes the aircraft nearly invisible to current detection systems. But perhaps most significantly, the F-47 serves as what strategists call a quarterback for manned, unmanned teaming operations. Each F-47 can simultaneously control up to 12 collaborative combat aircraft. AI-enabled drones that extend the fighter's sensor range, carry additional weapons, or serve as decoys. Think of it as one pilot commanding an entire squadron of unmanned wingmen. The strategic implications are staggering. Traditional fighter engagements assume roughly equal numbers of platforms engaging each other. The F-47 fundamentally breaks this assumption. A single aircraft can present multiple threat vectors simultaneously. Overwhelming adversary decision-making cycles. Enemy commanders won't just face one F-47. They'll confront a coordinated swarm of platforms operating with unprecedented precision. Boeing's manufacturing approach reflects lessons learned from fifth-generation production challenges. The company has invested heavily in advanced manufacturing facilities in Street, Louis. Implementing digital twin technology and automated production systems designed for rapid scaling. This isn't just about building aircraft, it's about building them fast enough to maintain America's technological advantage. The F-47's design philosophy embraces what military strategists call distributed operations, the ability to operate from austere or improvised airfields. This capability becomes crucial in contested environments where traditional airbases face constant threat from precision strike weapons. The aircraft can literally disappear into the tactical environment, emerging only when mission parameters demand. But here's what should terrify our adversaries most. Everything we've discussed represents known capabilities. The true revolutionary aspects of the F-47 remain classified, hidden behind layers of compartmented access programs that even defense analysts can only speculate about. China's response to American NGAD development reveals just how transformative they consider the F-47's capabilities. Beijing's simultaneous unveiling of both J-36 and J-56 generation fighters represents an unprecedented acceleration of their development timeline and a clear acknowledgement that existing Chinese platforms cannot match F-47 performance. The J-36's diamond wing configuration and 7.6-meter central weapons bay suggest Chinese engineers prioritized payload capacity over maneuverability, essentially creating a stealthy tactical bomber rather than a pure air superiority fighter. This design philosophy indicates Beijing recognizes it cannot match F-47 air-to-air -air capabilities, instead focusing on long-range strike missions. It's a telling strategic admission disguised as technological advancement. Russia's PAKDP program faces even more significant challenges. Western sanctions have severely limited access to advanced semiconductor technology essential for sixth-generation avionics. While economic constraints force slower development cycles, Russian engineers understand the technological requirements but lack the industrial base to match American production timelines. The F-47's drone integration capability represents a paradigm shift that adversaries struggle to counter effectively. Traditional air defense systems assume roughly predictable aircraft behavior patterns, and fighters operate individually or in small formations with human decision-making cycles. The F-47's ability to coordinate multiple AI-enabled platforms creates tactical scenarios that existing doctrine simply cannot address. Consider the mathematics. A single F-47 controlling 12 CCAs presents 13 simultaneous threat vectors. Enemy air defense operators must track, prioritize, and engage multiple contacts that may be real fighters, decoy drones, or electronic warfare platforms. This level of tactical complexity overwhelms human decision-making, forcing adversaries into reactive rather than proactive postures. The broader NGAD ecosystem compounds these advantages exponentially. The Air Force plans to field approximately 200 manned F-47 seconds, supported by over 1,000 collaborative combat aircraft, creating a 5-to-1 ratio of unmanned-to-manned platforms. 
This represents a fundamental multiplication of American air power without corresponding increases in pilot training requirements. NATO allies are watching F-47 development with intense interest, recognizing that interoperability with American sixth-generation systems will define alliance effectiveness for decades. European programs like the Global Combat Air Program and Future Combat Air System are explicitly designed for integration with American NGAD capabilities. The economic implications extend beyond pure military considerations. Boeing's F-47 production represents hundreds of thousands of high-technology jobs across multiple states, while associated research and development spawns innovations that benefit civilian aerospace sectors. America's defense industrial base gains capabilities that competitors simply cannot match. Most critically, the F-47 program demonstrates American commitment to maintaining technological superiority regardless of cost. President Trump's personal announcement of the Boeing contract selection sends unmistakable signals to adversaries about national priorities. This isn't just about building better fighters, it's about ensuring American air power remains unchallenged for the foreseeable future. Remember, we're discussing a weapon system designed to operate effectively through the 2050 seconds and beyond. The technological foundations being established now will determine whether America maintains air superiority or faces contested skies for the first time since World War II. The stakes couldn't be higher, and our adversaries know it. The F-47's emergence fundamentally rebalances global power projection capabilities in America's favor. For the first time since the F-22's introduction, the United States possesses a fighter aircraft that our adversaries cannot match with existing technology. This capability gap creates strategic opportunities that haven't existed since the end of the Cold War. In the Indo-Pacific theater, the F-47's 1,000-plus nautical mile combat radius transforms tactical possibilities. American forces can now conduct deep strike operations from bases outside the range of Chinese intermediate-range ballistic missiles, fundamentally altering the strategic geometry of potential conflicts. Beijing's anti-access Area denial strategy depends on keeping American air power at maximum range. The F-47 eliminates that advantage. The drone integration capability creates exponential force multiplication effects that traditional military planning cannot adequately model. Each F-47 essentially fields the combat power of an entire squadron while requiring only one pilot and maintenance crew. This efficiency allows America to project disproportionate air power with minimal logistical footprint. European NATO allies view F-47 capabilities as essential for deterring Russian aggression while maintaining alliance interoperability. The aircraft's advanced networking systems ensure seamless integration with allied platforms creating a unified air defense architecture that Russia cannot effectively challenge. The broader implications extend into arms control and strategic stability. The F-47's capabilities are so advanced that existing treaty frameworks may require fundamental revision. Traditional metrics like aircraft numbers become meaningless when single platforms can coordinate entire swarms of unmanned systems. Economically, the F-47 program demonstrates America's willingness to invest whatever resources are necessary to maintain technological superiority. The Pentagon's $3.5 billion budget request for fiscal 2026 represents just the beginning of a multi-decade investment program. This level of commitment sends unmistakable signals to adversaries about American priorities. Perhaps most significantly, the F-47 establishes technological baselines that will influence military aviation for generations. The adaptive cycle engines, advanced stealth materials, and AI integration systems developed for NGAD will eventually filter into civilian aerospace applications. America isn't just building a better fighter, we're pioneering the technologies that will define 21st century aviation. The message to adversaries is clear. America remains committed to maintaining overwhelming technological superiority, regardless of cost or complexity. The F-47 represents not just military capability,
but national resolve to defend American interests globally. In an era of great power competition, this technological demonstration carries strategic weight beyond pure military applications. The Boeing F-47 represents more than technological advancement. It embodies America's unwavering commitment to maintaining air superiority in an increasingly contested world. Three key takeaways define this revolutionary platform's significance. First, the F-47's unprecedented range and stealth capabilities fundamentally alter strategic geography, allowing American air power to reach targets previously beyond effective range. Second, its drone integration systems create force multiplication effects that render traditional air defense planning obsolete. Third, the aircraft establishes technological baselines that ensure American aerospace dominance for decades to come. But there's more beneath the surface, because the F-47 isn't just designed as a standalone asset, it's the nerve center of a new U.S. Air Force doctrine built around networked warfare and collaborative combat. This next-generation strategy puts the F-47 inches the lead role as a mothership, orchestrating missions with a fleet of semi-autonomous drones known as Collaborative Combat Aircraft CCA. Each F-47 will command and control multiple CCAs, assigning roles in real time, whether electronic warfare, reconnaissance, or strike, without direct human intervention. This is human-machine, teaming at a scale never before deployed. That autonomy is more than just a technical marvel. It fundamentally changes how air campaigns will be fought and won. Enemy networks and sensors will face not just one threat track, but a dynamic constellation of manned and unmanned assets working together, swapping data, saturating defenses, and multiplying effects. For rival planners in Beijing and Moscow, this shift forces a complete rethink of how they manage their own air defense, as coordinated swarms make old playbooks obsolete. The program's strategic investment signals a broader U.S. Commitment, a message to allies and adversaries alike. Backed by hundreds of billions over decades, the NGAD effort demonstrates America's willingness to outspend and out-innovate any competitor when it comes to protecting its interests and those of its partners. Production of the F-47 is supported by forward-looking upgrades across the entire U.S. Air Arsenal, from 5th-gen stalwarts like the F-22 and F-35 to the stealthy B-21 Raider bomber, forming an integrated, multi-layered shield of air dominance. Just as importantly, the F-47 sets a foundation for future systems and doctrines. Open integration frameworks, plug-and-play sensors, software-driven upgrades, and scalable autonomy will ensure that American warfighters stay ahead, not just for the next decade, but well into the mid-21st century. The entire approach is designed to adapt quickly, outpace emerging threats, and empower tactical decision-makers with unmatched situational awareness. As production begins and flight testing approaches, one reality becomes clear. America has once again redefined the cutting edge of military aviation. While adversaries scramble to match capabilities they barely understand, the F-47 will soon patrol skies where no enemy aircraft dares venture. The future of air warfare is here, and it bears American markings. Drop a comment below with your thoughts on the F-47's strategic impact, smash that like button if this analysis provided new insights, and subscribe for weekly deep dives into the systems keeping America secure.